and welcome to another video. This one is about getting materials up and managing materials and getting them up into the loft. A lot of uh, loft conversion videos gloss over the fact that it's blooming hard work getting all these heavy materials up three storeys up into the loft. What you can see here is common. They dumped a load of materials on my drive and I had to move them somewhere to store them safely and then onwards I'll move them up. So enjoy watching the, um, the, the efforts and I'll talk to you in a minute. Well, this is what 42 pieces of nine by threes look like. So you can see the three underneath. Great big delivery, and I've got to carry all these one by one to get them in there. Jeepers. This is how I'm getting them in. One plank behind, way up to the window, and then I lift up the, the beam, which is on the outside, and put one of these in at a time to get it as high and as much through the window as I can before I go to the inside. So, this is the top of the stairs, the top of the beam. There we just through the window. Now, the darker colour, these are wet and it makes them a lot, lot heavier. So I think this one's going to be a bit of a challenge. Right. This is me getting the timbers up into the loft. It propped up on a... on a... Uh, a step down there to get it as high as I can. These things are more than 30 kilos, 65, 70 pounds weight. I've already done one, so I know I can do it, but it is hard work. And I'm not sure it's safe, but this is what I'm having to do to get these timbers up in. So I've made them, this one's four meters long. The others are gonna be 3.9, because I can shave a little bit off and it might not sound much, but Anyway, this one's stuck. I don't want to drop it. get as high as I can and then I drag the other one in and then it started to move this one if I want to Oh, 
And then, oh, we're just gonna get up on the top step. Oh, we just want this wiggle is. Oh, oh. At least, I can rest for a second here. Oh. It's in at least. Oh, holy shamoy. Well, it's in. Oh, I've got 42 of those to do. I'm going to need some help. I'm a bit worried about this one. This is so heavy. Just because it's wet, it was delivered wet. There's nothing I've done, but you really notice the difference between the dry ones and the wet ones. And this one must be oh, as much again. So keep your timber dry. I'm out of breath because I've just pulled this beam through that window up these stairs and here it is the first beam first joist four meters long nine by three and it is really heavy so now I've somehow got to maneuver it through here into its position and I'm trying to work out whether I do the the first one first or the second I might do the second one first because then I can rest on that for the others. You wish me luck. So there you have me trying to kill myself getting the first two beams in. Actually, that day I did eight beams um, and, and laid them out in the, in the loft. Um, I realised I just needed help because that was stupid. But it just gives you an indication of the effort that you have to go through to get materials. And this was just a joist. All the rafters, all the floorboards plasterboard these things generally weigh about 20 kilos so one person can lift them within limits 
but you have to either manipulate them up through a window, up onto scaffolding, or through the house up your staircase and get them up that way. So it's blooming hard work. So I hope you enjoyed me busting my spleen. Um, from now onwards, we're starting to build. Bye.